So we have stopped here for two minutes. Break. Now we will shift to two mode. Just shift right. ideal mode to ride on this bike turbo is fun to drive but tour is the mode to drive so currently the range is showing 63 and it will improve once i'm riding about 25 so let's see is to stay as left as you can from this line and these mirrors they really do help a lot uh, whenever there is a heavy vehicle coming you can be alerted with the 16 kilometers to go in my friend's residence So the range has popped up to 67 and you see when I was uh, just started I on two mode it was 63 now it's 67 once you are above 25 uh, the BMS and the boss system uh, update itself.
इनिशियली वैन यू स्टार्ट द राइड समाइम्स यू फील भाई पंगा ले लिया बट वंस यू आर इन टू द राइड एंड टेन टू फाइव किलोमीटर आई थिंक सेवन टू एट किलोमीटर्स डाउन वंस यू स्टार्ट राइडिंग देन यू स्टार्ट एंजॉइंग द राइड नाउ करेंटली इट्स लाइक आई एम एंजॉइंग द राइड and uh, you can see the range still in 57 once we started on the tour mode it was telling 67 and we have driven around 20 kilometers on it so this recalibrates everything recalibrates that's the beauty of uh, a bot system it just recalibrates to your right so we have reached destination so uh, in the video you must have uh, seen uh, the overview of the bike as well as the drive review of the bike so uh, one or two things which i missed was so this is this all is touch screen this uh, you see uh, this display i on to which or touch screen this uh, another thing which i missed was this lupine uh, headlight which is uh, this uh, let's just switch on the headlight from here so it's on now yeah so it's an integrated one yes uh, currently the the it's in the DRL mode it's auto uh, mode it will uh, it has an automatic light sensor uh, once it's dark it will lit up itself so uh, another thing which i uh, this was a walk assist in the you bike so there is a switch over here so uh, this walk assist helps you sometimes you have to uh, key uh, sometimes you have to take your bike to from the stairs or there is a slope uh, to you know, to precise so once i have pressed this button uh, then i will to press this button so this is in the walk assist so like it's moving with this we will move it here so this is how this walk assist works that's the demo of the uh, walk assist mode in the e-bike so you have to press it and hold this plus button for long so then it, and on the display it will start coming like i'm pressing this long button so it comes walk assist so that's the demo of the walk assist uh, which i missed uh, in the previous video another thing uh, it, it's a removable display it's a removable display and uh, this is a touch screen which i missed initially and you can remove it there is a point over here let's uh, let's show you how to remove it so that so it comes out uh, so even uh, once it comes out you can have those all those this uh, uh, all those details around here yeah here it is the usb Oh, and I'm not sure if it is for uh, charging the smartphone or not. I will just try and update whether it's for charging uh, this or yeah, it's for. I think it's for charging the for charging the this display, this one. Uh, not no, while I'm not sure about it, I will check and surely will update. Uh, so this is it. Now this was uh, the re uh, a long review, I guess, of 
Scott e-bike. And another thing is I've dri driven it in rain. Uh, there's no problem. You can drive it in rain. Well, it's, it's not like that. It can't be driven in rain. This one, uh, this, and, yeah, give you that low battery sign of the bat of the e-bike and all those things. So it's pretty much, uh, yeah, like the battery sign shows. So this is, this was the review of my uh, mid-drive e-bike e ride 10 and uh, most of the people think that uh, riding an e-bike will uh, not give you those kind of exercise so that's not the case uh, e-bike will, e will keep you hooked for more rather than conventional uh, cycling in conventional cycling uh, so these e-bikes keep you hooked for long and yes that's it thank you